Okay, this is going to be a reading called Ten Dates. And uh, if you've followed it all through the thousand videos, you see a tremendous change. The first was just rage and, and uh, catharsis, and then it's just moved on to becoming comfortable in front of the camera. And if that were easy, everybody would be doing it. But it's not easy. This is the hardest thing I've done. It's like a, a dissertation. And um, I'm really, really proud. So here we go. This is earlier on. Four, five, six years ago. My life is a mess. I live in a motel. When I was homeless, there were mice, but they were really nice. Night clerk, I'd love to take off her shirt. I bet she was a dirty girl. I was impressed to take off her party dress. I think she was too, but what do you do? Boyfriend just out of jail, did mixed martial arts and worked as a bouncer. I'd walk real fast when I saw his car. My Dave, my mate Dave pretty much saved my ass with his car. You can only walk so far. Trip back 30 years, 19. This explains a lot, a lot of what I mean. It explains a lot of the fits I got. There was this guy, and he'd tell you what you wanted to hear. Everything was roses. Just stay near to the delusion he proposed. Take away all fears. He was a wanker. He was only 19. New to the scene. Totally naive. This motherfucker, Eric, was a prick with a purpose. He clearly thought he was a shit, and he made me believe it. Off to boot camp, Newport Beach. Christian missionary outreach. Suffering for Jesus. I liked it. It was okay. Had no schema to say no anyway. Drilled into my head the seeds that decayed, that made me crazy, fucked up religious ways. Oh well, everyone's got their cross to bear. And there was this girl at, at the night clerk. I brought a Red Bull and chocolate. I thought of her when I jerked. I'd go downtown in a second if there's no boyfriend to reckon. Fuck ten girls with no protection. The craziest, insane stupidest thing and ended up getting a disease or uh, infection early internet was a wild west got the green light prayer and erections angels fluttered and demons fled without ever being detected i got candida and i broke my dick fuck like a porn star with an afrinal shit it wasn't aids it wasn't herpes wash twice away and the smell goes away nice christian girl she was a sex addict when I asked how many she had it, she came and then gave me the rash. Hurt my neck to keep her coming back. So there's my story. High hell, little glory. I regret a few things, happy about others. Sometimes I think if I had my druthers. If I had my druthers, maybe I'd throw it all away and just go fishing. And that's about all I gotta say. Yeah. Another fuck ending. <laughs>